My name is Zairin Karuga. I'm the head of leasing at Jamibora Leasing. Today we are going to visit Umati Capital, who was our first customer. That was the first lease contract that we signed in February 2016. Today we are here to introduce them to Tim, who's one of the directors at Jamibora Leasing, and also just to let him hear their story and how we were able to fit in to offer them a solution. The story of Umati Capital is very simple. When we started the company, the idea was, was to provide just basic financing without the necessary challenges faced with collateral or assets. So we've been in the market now for about four years. This year, we're now developing heavy on our technology because that's the only way we will scale. So to give you an idea, our new project in Rwanda would be controlled from here and very minimal footprint in Rwanda or boots on the ground in Rwanda. And it may not necessarily be lending from day one, but it's just using our technology. We use technology to extract data from our clients to understand how best to lend to them. So in Umati, we have a tech team uh, which builds all our applications, both mobile and web. So the kind of equipment we require is actually the high-end MacBooks. Um, and uh, as you can imagine, such equipment is actually expensive in our, in our region. And when we came about uh, Jamil Borough leasing, it, it was a perfect relationship because we just raised some money. So rather than actually buying the laptops ourselves, which unfortunately a lot of startups have to spend a lot of money on, and with Jamil Borough leasing, we were able to lease it for as low as 9,500 to maximum of about 12,000 shillings uh, per month. Now compare that to an actual cost of about 160,000 to one of our laptops costing a quarter of a million shillings. Um, the saving there is just it's, it speaks for itself. Uh, Jamie Bora Leasing is actually a subsidiary of Jamie Bora Bank. And um, our history traces back a year ago. We actually started our operations in January 2016. And uh, we are a leasing company that basically caters for the uh, small and medium enterprises. The reason why we decided to focus on SMEs is mainly because Jamibora as a bank uh, serves the enterprise segment and one of the things we realize with enterprises is that apart from the working capital needs that they have which are served by the bank, they also need to acquire assets. And that's how Jamibora leasing came into being. Our story started in January 2016 and as, as part of our, our story, we wanted to, to go back to the clients we started with to basically recap and see what have we done for them. So the solutions that we offer cut across various sectors. One of the sectors that we've had the privilege to serve is the financial sector. It's now been about uh, a year with that relationship and it's been fantastic. So each time we have a new staff member joining, um, Jimmy Bora, we just give them a call and tell them, hey, we need one more laptop. They give us the price of the lease. If we have an employee leaving, um, it's just as simple as returning the laptop to, to Jimmy Bora Leasing. Other than that, it's been a good relationship and I look forward to a partnership where we can refer more clients to one another. Through our innovative solution of leasing, we've been able to address one of the headaches that an enterprise suffers when they start out and when they grow. We have seen that through this solution, we've been able to enable them achieve their dream in terms of growth using technology to basically serve the underserved market, especially in the agribusiness sector. And for us, this story is a beginning of many more to come where we would like entrepreneurs to know that beyond the conventional asset finance, Jamibora Leasing is offering an innovative solution to help various sectors embrace um, asset acquisition at minimal cost. So the future holds um, a few bright moments for uh, Jamibora and Umati. So for example, would like to invite uh, Jamibora into where we work, which is a, a shared space for entrepreneurs. It's called Narabi Garage, where they can come and talk to some of the entrepreneurs about the benefits of leasing equipment rather than owning it. Um, and the good thing about Jamibora is that they're flexible enough to make time to engage with uh, stakeholders. Yeah.